this is TJ. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to download and install the program Blender on your Windows computer. I'm using Windows 8, and these instructions will also work for Windows 7 or Windows XP. First thing you want to do is open up your internet browser. I'm using Firefox. You could also use Chrome or Internet Explorer. And go to Google and just type in Download Blender, and then press Enter, or you can click the search button. And it looks like the first result that comes up for me is the one I want, blender.org slash download. You may have some ads between this result, so you might just scroll down to see it a little bit. But you're going to want to go to blender.org for the download. And then once that page loads, the reason I do the Google search is so that I get the latest um, version. You could also just go to blender.org, um, but, but find the latest version. So this is 2.71 for Windows. Looks like it's the latest version. So I'll scroll down. It says it's compatible with 8, 7, and Vista. Oh, I forgot about Vista. <laughs> um, and uh, so I have a 64-bit. If you have a computer that you've bought in the last five years, um, it's probably a 64 has a 64-bit processor. And if you're not sure, just go with a 32-bit. So I'm going to click on this USA under 64-bit, and this will start my download. So I'll click Save File. Okay, so my download just barely finished. So I will click, left click on the download there. Then that sound that came up was Windows saying, do you want to open this program? So I said, click yes, and that's what you'll want to do too. Then click next. Click I agree. This just uh, will keep all these boxes checked and click next. This says where we're going to save it at on our computer under program files. So we'll just click install. And it will begin installing. And I think I'll pause the video and I'll just resume it again once it's done installing and I'll show you, uh, well that's basically it, but I'll pause the video now. Okay, and now we are done installing Blender. So this box that's checked just says we're going to run it after we click finish, so I'll click finish and it should just open right up. And 